Okay guys, before the video starts, please make sure to go to Discord and under the development category, there should be a channel called Framework and there should be a file that you should download. Here's a reference image of how it's supposed to be set up in Roblox. And also please make sure that your HTTP and API services are turned on in your game settings. Hey guys, today I'm going to show you guys how to set up the vehicle spawner version 3. So, um... To begin, you have to make sure you have these three folders, the notification system, the vehicle spawner, and the framework. And you want to set up the framework by ungrouping these models into the required locations. So like this, for example, has, this framework has to go into the replicated storage, so you just want to drag and drop that to your replicated storage. And yeah, just put everything in the way they need to be. And once you've done that, just want to drag and drop these two folders, uh, which is the vehicle spawner and the notification system, you can either cut it or drag and drop it into the um, underneath the framework. You have to go into the systems and just paste that in there. And okay, I have more than one notification system. Make sure you guys only have one notification system. And after you've done that, the system is basically set up. You just need to go back into the README and take these two folders and paste them under the workspace okay perfect okay um, over in the vehicle spawner uh, you have a dealer tab and you have a spawner tab so here we can name name it to our teams you can put um, civilian and you can put police or whatever other team that you have Okay, and you can name your spawners to the team as well. Okay, and over here we have different locations now, so you guys can like put. Um, okay, so like let's say I want this spawner, I want this location. Sorry, um, to let's let's just say point one, and then this location here to point two. Okay, so to set up the locations, I believe we have to come over here. Okay, yes. In the assets, you can you have in the assets folder you have to put your teams as well. So whichever um, vehicles you're putting, whatever whichever vehicles you're putting in, it has to come in the assets folder. So just police. Okay, so for example, this vehicle I have here. I can just cut that and I can paste that underneath vehicles here. And this is the new this is the new um config for the vehicles, so I just have to paste that in there. Perfect. Okay, so as you guys can see, it works, the, the spawner works. Okay, so basically for the locations, um, so whichever location plot or point that the user is closer to, the vehicle will spawn. So I can probably put this point way over here and I can put another dealership over here and the car will now spawn to that specific location. And if you guys have trouble understanding the setup, you guys can always just go over to the README in the vehicle spawner folder. There is a README here. You guys can just go to this README and you guys can start it. And you guys can read. And yeah, if you guys are still getting any trouble setting up this, you guys can contact us in the Discord and we'll be there to assist you.